Over the last 25 years, Maddie and I have made countless of memories. Vacationing as little girls, taking gymnastics at the YMCA, and eventually hearing all about a boy named Sam. From a very young age, Maddie always knew what she wanted from high school cheerleading, gymnastics, Sam, to college and Sam, to blogging and Sam. So the one thing that's been consistent in all of Maddie's phases in life is Sam. And a lot of you may not know, you may be a plus one, you may not be on social media, uh, but Maddie's kind of a big deal. So let me take a second to brag on Maddie. She is the founder, CEO, and president of Ott Style. Uh, yep. And for those that are uh, uh, unsure what that is, um, that is a fashion and lifestyle blog. She is the uh, creative graphic design executive and CEO of Blackhawk Mining and Graphic Design and Man Manchester Music Hall. She's a beautiful young entrepreneur, basically, short. Um, and, um, but of all her talents, features, attributes, amazing things she's accomplished in her young life, uh, by far the best thing she's ever done is land my little brother. Maddie, you're very become very strong and confident woman. Very driven. You know what you want. You know who you want to be. I admire your strong faith in God and family. It's a privilege to be your dad. Maddie, here's what Sam had to say about wanting to be married to you. He said, marrying Maddie is something I've known I would do for about eight years now. <laughs> this is a theme. You're going to hear more of this, all right? There really has never been a doubt in my mind that she was the one. It just took me a while to feel like I was ready for marriage. Being together for as long as we have means that she truly knows me. And the fact that she still wants to marry me is pretty awesome. I've never met someone that cares more about others than Maddie. She always puts others and me first. She is by far the best thing that has happened in my life, and I'm so excited for what our future holds. I think every little girl dreams of her wedding day. I was a tomboy, so weddings and dresses weren't something I really thought much of when I was young until I met Sam in 2009. I can remember the exact spot I was standing in when I realized I wanted to be his wife one day. 
I have had the honor of loving him for the last nine years, and it has been such a blessing to watch him grow as a friend, son, and partner. I'm sure you can agree, and it doesn't get much better here on earth than Sam Duff. And I thank God every day for allowing me to see that at a young age. Something I think everyone who gets the pleasure to meet him sees, he is so special. He's humble, one of the most humble people I know. He's a leader without even trying. He's kind and generous, never fails to make me laugh. And he has this amazing ability to pick others up when they're down. At the risk of sounding too cheesy, I truly fall more in love with him every single day. And I don't know how I got so lucky sometimes. I know God put him in my life at the perfect time. A lot of my life has changed throughout the years, but one of the only things that has remained the same besides my faith in God is Sam. We've talked about this day for years, and I can't tell you how many times I've just sat and talked with Maddie and just thought of this day, and for it finally to be here is, is so surreal. And I often dreamed about the day she would become a deaf. You're more than just my sister-in-law, and Sam is more than just my brother. You're forever my lifelong friend, and my heart truly couldn't be any more happy. Everyone here knows how loving Maddie is to each and every one of us, but the, love, the way she loves Sam is unlike any I've ever seen. After all, after all of these years, she says that he still gives her butterflies and makes her hot race. Sam, today is the day that I'm marrying the boy I've loved since I was 16. I knew it then, and I know it even more today, that you are special and you were made for me. Through the best and worst moments of my life, one thing has and always will remain, us. Sometimes I feel like we're still the same 16 or 17 year old kids that first fell in love with each other. It's crazy that now I'm 26 years old and I still feel the same about you. Thank you so much for always being such a constant in my life. You've always been someone that I can count on to be there for me. I cannot wait to start a family with you. I'm not only positive you will be a great wife, but I know that you're going to be an amazing mother, and I can't wait to grow old with you. And I know that no matter what obstacles face, we're going to face them together. I love you so much. I've loved you for nearly a decade, and it's been the easiest thing I've ever done. You are the most kind, caring, and humble person, and you without a doubt make me a better one. You are every single thing I've prayed for and more. Thank you for always helping me keep things in perspective, plan a little less, and be a little more laid back. You truly are my better half. I love you, your wife, Maddie.